This will, believe it or not, be my first attempt at taking off a ram ship. Oh wow, it's actually kind of easy. It's not that hard. I put it, I'm at 200 degrees Celsius, I believe. I think I'm overheating it though. <laughs> Look, I just took off the ram chip. Yeah, well, it's not hard. It wasn't hard. It's underfilled. This is six plus. Six plus. Uh, I think so, yeah. I guess we can maybe just put a little flux on it or. You know, I feel like it's too hot, though. Let's turn the thing down. I'm going to turn down to 120. My preheater. Okay. All right, man, we're ready. Data recovery. Chip off. Okay, so should I take off the ramp, the CPU too? Have you have you ever taken off a CPU or? You did it on a customer's phone, right? <laughs> oh wow, this is still really hot, man. Well, I don't think I ripped any pads or anything, so that's good news. Oh wow, it's a little bit underfill. Looks pretty good. I mean, it was very easy to take off, but it's underfilled. I mean, I mean, what are the odds, huh? What are the odds of getting this off? And I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure all these little balls right here mean that the CPU is actually jacked up too, probably. So. So still, is it gonna be? You know, I guess you have to play around with the thing a little bit, but preheater a little bit, but eh, we'll see how useful it is. Maybe we'll find some use for it somewhere at some point. I guess it's doable. Anyways, this thing is really hot still. It's 138 degrees Celsius, and then. So this is kind of what it looks like. It comes with this. Uh, this thing is really hot. I'm at 132 degrees Celsius now, but you can see it was. Uh, it came off fairly easily. Um, and I guess you know it's gonna probably just gonna take a little time to experiment with the. Woo! That's hot. And then I ended up buying the iPhone X attachment too, which looks like this. And I think this one was about 55 bucks or so. So. I do have an iPhone X board here, which I'm. Let me just see what it looks like right now. So, so let's see. So if I were to do this, it'd just be like this. Okay, that worked. So iPhone X, and it just kind of clamps down like this, or whatever. And then you can, and then I think probably this board right here goes on top of here, maybe or something. Or I don't. I'm not even sure what this is. Okay, so this one goes over here. It can go either way, looks like, once I take it off. Okay, so that's cool. Uh, but I have a feeling that maybe it's probably just going to sit here for a little bit <laughs> until we find some real use for it, which I tend to buy stuff and never use them, like this NAND reader uh, that I spent 500 bucks on, the success and up NAND reader. That I don't even know how to use. And now here we got this thing, which is uh, self-explanatory. But uh, we'll see if there's any use for it. All right. So I think it's hopeful that we may use this. Uh, so there you go. And maybe I can't really show you what it looks like. Maybe I'll take a picture of it or something like that. Yeah, maybe I'll take a picture of it.
include it. Unless I can take this off. Yeah, let's take this off. There it goes. Okay. Are you guys gonna see my workstation? Actually, I can't really even pull it. No. Anyways, let's see if it looks. You see it? That's what it looks like right there. PP. Okay. Wish I can zoom in. Can't see what's on my computer.